Hey you guys, God bless all of you. Welcome to My Creed Outdoors. Thanks for watching. Guys, in this video I'm going to show you a trick that I learned here a few years ago about how to keep your favorite axe head soundly mounted on that handle, guys. There's nothing more, nothing more frustrating than out here using your favorite axe and that head or that handle start slipping off of the head and you're constantly trying to do this number to keep it in place while you're using it. I don't care how good, guys, that you can mount one. Uh, even factory-mounted heads will come loose. Sorry about that axe there. <clears throat> and I did the same thing to this splitting maul right here. You see me using the other day. I've got another little axe, guys. This little bitty axe right here. I've done the same thing to it. So... This is going to be a really short and sweet how-to video, you guys. I'm not going to do the drilling or the tapping right here. I'm just going to show you what I've done. All right, you guys, you see that little thing right there that looks like a bolt? That's exactly what that is. I took a quarter 20 tap and a 3 16 drill bit, drilled the hole, and then tapped this handle on to this axe, you guys. I took a quarter 20 bolt and screwed it all the way down. I didn't go through the other side because you don't have to. So you tap this little bolt into here, cut it off and then grind it down smooth. And this handle, you guys, ain't coming off of this axe. I don't care how dry it gets. That's pretty simple. Now this old axe right here, you guys, you've probably seen me using this as well. Years ago, I just took a bolt because the handle kept slipping off of the head. I just took a quarter 20 bolt and went completely through that, that handle right there. The thing is never going to slip off of the head. It never has. And I've cut a million miles of brush with this little axe right here, you guys. So that's the way you do it. And you can see right there, I've done the same thing to that splitting maul. That splitting maul was, even though I put a new handle on it, you guys, just kept coming loose. I don't care how good and snug you put it on there, that's what's going to happen. So that's just a tip, you guys, that you can use to, to uh, keep from getting hurt and to keep from getting frustrated from them handles flying off of the of your tool. So you guys, for that project, all you will need is a quarter 20 bolt, one quarter 20 bolt, one quarter 20 tap, and one 3 16 drill bit. Drill your hole, tap it, put that in the handle, and you're done for good on that one. If you break the handle, it's very simple, you guys, to get that out. You just take a drill and drill out the, the excess wood around that screw, and you can just take that screw and turn it right back out. Thanks for watching Mike Creed Outdoors, you guys. God bless all of you. Have yourself a great day.